Conceptualize as you may the boy who cried wolf as a real wolf approaches. Now picture the boy as a bot and the pasture as an oven. As the bot warns all who will listen about the growing danger, he finds himself on a mission to destroy closets for reasons the bot cannot yet understand. We now return you to Locke's Tales of Beyond. The Major, the Lock, and the Wardrobes help Lock overcome his fears by destroying potential monster hiding places. Destroy closets that may harbour monsters in the suburban and urban zones. Okay then. So you got your urban, that's the city location, and suburban is this one, suburbs. So I think we'll go to city, I think. Oh, yeah, we'll go to this city. See where the monsters are harboring. Our primary objective? Do not leave the oven, sir. What is our secondary objective? Do not think about being full of rice and quinoa and fall into a panic spiral, sir. Tertiary objective. Rotate every 30 minutes. Uh, what is our first non-oven related objective? Hiding from the monster? <laughs> we don't hide. We hunt. Look alive, Rosoto. We're gonna find that monster of yours. There's again, there we go. Why are we attacking closets? Smart question. You want to put the enemy on the defensive? Get him where he lives. Where do monsters live? In the hearts and minds of our friends and neighbors? No, they live in closets. What are you reading in there? Jess's illustrated true crime compendium. Seriously, Jess? What? It's got a lot of pictures. It's not like he can read. He can read! Unfortunately, I can, yeah. <laughs> Dismissed. Recruits, clean out that closet. One of our drones has taken damage. We can't let the husks destroy the drone. Head to the crash site. Take out those husks. Consider yourselves evicted. Consider yourselves banished, monsters. Banished. What we need closets. Here's Take one. out the enemies to clear the encampment. Another closet safe. Okay. Thanks for letting me know. Is that it? It's a blast. Should we destroy more monster hiding spots? Yes. I don't know. Kid, I'm trying here. You want to cut me some slack? Sorry. The oven light burned out. And I wasn't prepared for things to get sadder. Or scarier. Don't worry, Locke. We will fix it. Locke, buddy, I have some bad news. We can't open the oven to install the new light without causing a major temperature fluctuation. But don't worry. Dennis came up with a solution. We're going to shine a bunch of flashlights into the oven. It should light the place up for you. And, thanks to the Panopticon effect, you'll never feel alone. Well, okay then. Another one down! Closet down! Was that it? Wow. I feel safer already. How about you? I'll never feel safe again. Thanks for trying. But my monster doesn't live in a closet. What? Why didn't you tell me sooner, son? Am I done? Nope. That's the shift change bell. You've still got 50... Oh, uh... You don't want to know. Well, good night. Don't let the bed bugs burn.